Hello dear students, welcome to a new episode. In this episode we'll be talking about comparing the measures of angles of triangle. Theorem number one says, in a triangle, if two sides have unequal lengths, then the longer is opposite to the angle of the greater measure. So, as you can see here in triangle ABC, in which AB is greater than AC, then the measure of angle ACB is greater than the measure of angle ABC. Let's remember that in a triangle, the longest side in length is opposite to the greatest angle in measure, while the shortest side in length is opposite to the smallest angle in measure. Exercise number one, choose the correct answer. Question one, in triangle ABC, if AB is greater than AC, then the measure angle A is, what would measure angle B? Yes, excellent, is greater than measure of angle B. In triangle ABC, if AB is greater than AC, then B is less than C as angles. Question three, in triangle ABC, if AB is greater than AC, and the measure of angle C is 70 degrees, then the measure of angle B may be, yes, excellent, 50, which is less than angle C, which is 70 degrees. Question four, in triangle ABC, if BC is greater than AB, then the measure of angle A is greater than the measure of angle C. Question five, in the triangle XYZ, if XY is greater than XZ, then the measure of angle Y is less than the measure of angle Z. Question six, in triangle ABC, if AB is nine centimeters long, where BC is six centimeters and AC is seven centimeters, then the smallest angle is the angle opposite to BC, which is angle ABC. Exercise number two, in the opposite figure, where ABCD is a quadrilateral in which AD is equal to DC and BC is greater than AB. The question wants us to prove that the measure of angle BAD is greater than the measure of angle BCD. So I will say here in triangle ACB, BC is greater than AB and this part is given. Therefore, the measure of angle CAB is greater than the measure of angle ACB. And we can name this number one. Since AD is equal to DC, which is also given, therefore, the measure of angle DAC is equal to the measure of angle DCA. If we add 1 plus 2, we will get that the measure of angle DCB is greater than the measure of angle DAB. In exercise number three, in the opposite figure, AD is greater than DC and AB is greater than BC. The question wants us to prove that the measure of angle BCD is greater than the measure of angle BAD. We're going to say since AD is greater than DC as given, therefore, the measure of angle DCA is greater than the measure of angle 
DAC. So this would be inequality number one. The second part, since AB is greater than CB as given, therefore, the measure of angle ACB is greater than the measure of angle CAB. If you add one and two together, we can get that the measure of angle BCD is greater than the measure of angle BAD. Exercise number four, in triangle ABC, if AB is 14 centimeters and BC is six centimeters and AC is 10 centimeters, the question wants us to arrange the angles of triangle ABC ascendingly due to their measure. We're going to say, since BC is smaller than AC, therefore, the measure of angle A is smaller than the measure of angle B. Let's call this inequality number one. Since AC is less than AB, therefore, the measure of angle B is less than the measure of angle C. We can say that from one and two, the smallest angle is A, then B, then C. So the measure of angle A is less than the measure of angle B, less than the measure of angle C. Let's now move on to the evaluation part. In the opposite figure, AB is equal to eight centimeters where BC is 7 centimeters, CD is 4 centimeters, and AD is 6 centimeters. The question wants us to prove that the measure of angle BCD is greater than the measure of angle BAD. We're going to make a construction by drawing AC segment. After that, you will see in triangle ACD, since AD is less than AC, therefore, the measure of angle ACD is greater than the measure of angle ADC. We'll call this inequality number one. In the other triangle, BAC, since BA is greater than BC, therefore, the measure of angle ACB is greater than the measure of angle BAC. And this is inequality number two. If you add one and two together, you will get that the measure of angle BCD is greater than the measure of angle BAD. And now, dear students, we came to the end of our session. Thank you very much and wishing you best of luck.